Because I think if we get a bunch of Hoonigan guys, we're going to burn through my one contact real quick. You know, you know who helped build these, right? Yeah, Rob. Of course. Rob's so smart. Rob Parsons, the man, the myth, the legend, Chair Slayer, actually helped design these bad boys. They're so cool. Big old turbo. Yeah. A Hayabusa motor what? with a fat old turbo on it. I think they just they just did Pike Speak with this thing. I want to drive this so bad. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> most definitely. I don't know if that's a good or a bad thing. I know Rob helped this design. This is Pike Speak. Yeah, they just did Pike Speak in this thing. We're gonna need you guys to sign media credentials if you're gonna be over here. Oh yeah? <laughs> What's up, man? How you doing? Doing real well. How are you? Did you, you guys just took this around Pike Speak, didn't you? Yeah, buddy. How'd it do? Uh, it's really fast. Yeah. I, I, but I the tires are susceptible to punctures. Uh, so they got a puncture, like, I think piece of carbon fiber or something right on Really? The that yeah. sucks. Because they wave the green flag here, 200 feet later you got the start line. Right. Between the green flag and start line, picked up. Literally? We have three camera angles of the right front tire driving over something, and it's devastating. That is devastating. because yeah, badass car for racing. I, uh, Rob and I are good friends, yeah. so we've been following this build, or I've been following this build yeah. as you guys went about it. So I was really excited to see this thing get to ribbon. How much power did it make? Uh, 310, the wheels on seven pounds of boost. Jeez. How much does it weigh? Uh, 1,100 pounds. 310 horsepower, 1,100 pounds, and it revs to what, 12? 11. 11? Yeah, you know, we're concerned. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, this is awesome. We had to beat the Honda S2000, you know? Right, 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 right. Rev past that, rev past what GT3s do, we're you gonna, know, the street cred. We're going to have to come visit the Live Motorsports Park, huh? Absolutely. I heard good things about it. Rob yeah. Rob talked it up really nicely, so. Well, I'm working on getting Rob back to Salt Lake here real soon. Yeah. So, you know, when he's not in Long Beach, he can be in Salt Lake. Well, Rob goes, I go, so yeah. I'll see you there. <laughs> <laughs> be first man in the cop car. We got a Crown Vic. That's uh, we, we we're having Crown Vic showdowns. Okay. Fastest lap, most air. You let me know when. You're welcome to bring your own. Let me know Vic. when, and we'll be there. Because I think if we get a bunch of Hoonigan guys, we're gonna burn through my one contact. <laughs> I used to have one, so I have experience. Oh. I, I used to have a P71. Yeah. I used to have a P71 also. I just stomp that brake. Let's party. Well, sounds good. Thanks for the invite. Hey, we'll keep in touch. Before I let you go, I noticed you had another one. Yeah, man. I didn't see this one. This, this is a rally cross version. So you make multiple different versions of, of your cross cart? One car, three different versions. So this, think of this as the evolution of the cross cart. This is the American cross cart. Okay. So, uh, bigger wheels and tires, bigger brakes, bigger engine. And you take one car and you can run in multiple configurations, whether you're on the asphalt, whether you're on the rally cross track, or you want to go out in the desert with your buddies. It's one car that does all three disciplines. So you change uh, wheels and tires out and you go rip. Yeah, this thing looks awesome. This is the naturally aspirated 200 horsepower engine. Um, that one, you got the turbo, we can wind up to about 500 horsepower over there, but it takes 91 octane and it's relatively stock engine, six speed sequential. Um, just under 900 pounds, so wow. the cross is a little bit lighter and, wow. and shreds for sure. 200 horsepower, 900 pounds, are you kidding? Are you kidding? Well, hopefully we can find ourselves in one of these bad boys soon. <laughs> Get to Utah, man. Yeah, we'll, we'll, the we'll, list is getting longer we'll, by the day. We'll come to Utah. We'll come to Utah and make a banger, make it worth your while.